Hey everyone. We're all done reading each other's poems, right? We have something we need to go over today, so if everyone could come sit at the front of the room. Is this about the festival? Well, sort of. Uh, do we really have to do something for the festival? It's not like we could put together anything good in just a few days. We'll just end up embarrassing ourselves instead of getting any new members. That's a concern of mine as well. I don't really do well with the last minute preparations. Don't worry so much. We're going to keep it simple, okay? Look, we know everyone's been a little more lively ever since Donnie joined, and we started with some club activities, but this isn't the time for us to become complacent. We still only have four members, and the festivals are our only real chance to find more, you know? So what's so great about getting new members anyways? We already have enough to be considered an official club. More members just mean everything goes noisier and more difficult to manage. Natsuki? I don't think you're looking at it the right way at all. Okay, I can't really tell the differences between them anymore. <clears throat> Should I keep up with my, um, my groggy voice? I think I will. Do you want- Nope. Nah, it's starting to hurt me. Do you want to share your passion with as many people as you can? To inspire them to, to find the same feeling that brought you here in the first place? The literature club should be the same place where people can express themselves like they can do anywhere else. It should be a place so intimate that you never want to leave. I know you feel that way too. I know we all do. So that's why we should work hard and put together, for, put something together for the festival, even if it's something small. Right, Donnie? Um, uh, oh, come on. You can't take advantage of Donnie to agree with you just because he doesn't know how to say no to anything. Look, Monica. Do you really think any of us here joined the club without other people in mind? Yuri never talked. Even. Yuri never even talked until Donnie joined. Wow. She never. talked until I joined? Okay. As for me, I like it. Be uh, I feel like she talks very high pitched and fast, so that's why I'm kind of doing that. It's kind of natural now. As for me, I like it better here than I do at home. And Donnie isn't even passionate about the literature in the first place. And that's everyone. Sorry, but you're really the only one who's interested in finding new members. The rest of us are fine like this. I know why you're present and all, but you should really consider our opinions for once. Monica's clearly taken back by Natsuki's words. That's not true at all. I'm sure Yuri and Donnie would want to get more members too, right? Oh. Oh. Damn. I don't know about Yuri, but I'm kind of indifferent. If I showed as much enthusiasm as Monica wanted, then I would probably be lying. Still, if it's up to me to rescue this situation, um, no. Natsuki's right, isn't she? This club, it's nothing more than a place for a few people to hang out. Why did I think that everyone here saw it the same way as I did? But that doesn't mean that we're against getting new members or anything. Donnie, why did you even join this club? What were you, cons what were you hoping to get out of it? Who, that middle bay? That is Monica. Monica's feels evil, by the way. That's not really something that I can be honest about, is it? Y you you missed me doing girly voices, Jeva. <laughs> yeah, she- Mo Monica's- If I didn't see what was going on, Monica would be best girl. However... Yuri could step on me any day. If I remember, you weren't even given a choice not to join. Monica sits downstairs at her desk. What's the point of all this anyways? What if starting this club was a mistake? Now you've done it, Natsuki. What? Me? I just spoke my mind. Is it a crime to be honest? It's not about being honest. It's about word choice. Besides, you have no right to speak for everyone else in the club like that. You don't understand at all. I just... I just want a place that feels nice to hang out with a few friends. Is there a problem with the club being that for me? There aren't... There aren't that many places like that for me. And now Monica wants to take it away from me. She's not taking anything away. No, she's not. Oh my god, she's like, no, Donnie. It's not the same. It won't be the same with the direction she wants to take it. And if I wanted that, 
then I could have just joined any other stupid club. But this one, I mean, at least for a little bit of time. Things were nice. Natsuki starts picking up her things. I'm going home. I feel like I don't belong here right now. Natsuki? Natsuki ignores Yuri and walks right out of the classroom. This is bad. I don't know what to do. Well, do you have an opinion on the festival? I don't... I, I don't know. I'm kind of indifferent, I guess. Who cares about the obnoxious brat? <sighs> okay. I mean, I like how nice and quiet the club is right now. And I'm just happy with you here. But still... I'm the vice president. It's not right for me to ignore my responsibilities like that. Nobody would cry if she killed herself. <coughs> oh god. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I should do my best to consider everyone's perspective and make the decision that's right for the club. But what about you, Donnie? What do you want to get out of this club? <laughs> Yuri repeats the same question as Monica. I decided giving an indirect answer was better than nothing. I think the most important thing is for everyone to get along, and for the club to provide something that you can't get anywhere else. I don't think it's about how many members, but rather the quality of each member. And that, that's what will end up making the Literature Club a special place. I see. I really agree with you. Each member contributes their own qualities in a special way. With each change in members, the identity of the club as a whole will change too. I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing, stepping out of your comfort zone once in a while. So if you would like to help Monica with the festival, then I'm on your side as well. Alright, well, maybe we could talk Natsuki tomorrow. I'm afraid to go on tomorrow. Hey Yuri! Eh? Um, you know, things were a little awkward yesterday, and I feel like you deserve to know that I still think you're a wonderful vice president, and uh, also a wonderful friend. Oh, Monica, I want to do everything I can to make this the best literature club ever, okay? Me too. Yeah, let's all go home for today and eat cupcakes. Okay. <laughs> I look forward to it. Shall we go, Donnie? Um, please don't take this the wrong way, but I'm going to chat a little bit... With Don Wait, why? Monica... You're not of interest right now. Yuri is of interest right now. Just to see what he thinks of the time here and all that. It's important to me as president. Yuri looks a little troubled, but she doesn't protest. Okay. I trust your judgment, Monica. In that case, I'll see the two of you tomorrow. Uh, I feel like... I feel like if, if Monica touches me, like just puts her hand on my shoulder, Yuri's gonna come out of nowhere and just fucking stab her with her fucking switchblade. <laughs> see you tomorrow. Monica waves Yuri. Waves as Yuri exits the classroom. Phew. Things have been a bit hectic lately, haven't they? Donnie, I just wanted to make sure you're enjoying your time at this club. I'd really hate to see you unhappy. I feel like I'm responsible for that as president. And I really do care about you, you know? I don't like seeing other girls give you a hard time. With how mean Natsuki is and everything. And Yuri being a little bit, you know. Ha ha ha. Sometimes I feel like you and I are the only real people here. You know what I mean? But it's weird. Because in all the times you've been here, we've hardly gotten to spend any time together. Uh, I mean... I guess it's technically only been a couple of days. Sorry, I didn't mean to say something weird. There's just some things that I've been hoping to talk to you about. With you about. Mm. Things I only know you can understand. So that's why... Wait, 
Not yet. No. Am I supposed to save Monica? Like, what's going on? Feels bad, man. Um, let's go with suicide. I'm s I'm still going after Yuri. Empty. Uh, contamination. Bliss. Massacre. Fantasy? No. Wait, what the fuck? Look at the number. <laughs> what? One, 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 one. In binary? That would be, um, so two. Oh no, that's, that's one. Three. That's two. Yeah, one, two, four, eight. That's way more than 20, so that's not right. Breathe, heartbeat, um, after image, infinite, ah, uh, fickle, desire, tenacious, heaven sent, it's a chocolate, oh damn it, You're supposed to be her. Oh my god, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Okay, three more. Seventeen. Alright, so I'm at seventeen. Alright, alright, whatever. Climax. What? What? Did you see that shit? On the bottom? Climax. What, what was that? Like, there was a hidden... That was Monica? There's a hidden way to get Monica? I need to do that. She jumps from time to time? Huh. Okay. Hey, Donnie. I've been waiting for you. Not really. You've been waiting for me, huh? Are you ready to continue reading? I brought my best tea today. Monica! I told you not to. Ugh. She really late again. Inconsiderate as usual, Natsuki. Excuse me? Must you always interrupt my conversations with your incessant yelling? What are you talking about? You say that like I do it on a regular basis or something. I was just I was just wasn't paying attention, okay? I'm sorry. Seriously, what's gotten into you lately? Me? N nothing. <laughs> is it really that bad? See, it is something. I I'll get over it. It's not even anything noteworthy. I've just been feeling a little on edge lately. Anyway, we don't need to talk about it. Well, I just felt like I needed to bring it up. It's not like I really care or anything. Oh man! I'm the last one here again. Well, Donnie just walked in too. Are you practicing piano again? Uh, they all sound the same. <laughs> I'm, I'm so bad at voicing. Yeah, ahaha. Uh, ha. You must have gone a You must have a lot of determination standing out at the club. So trying to make time for piano? Well, it's not. Determination, but I guess passion. It motivates me to work hard for the festival and, uh, um, uh, right. I forgot. About that. We're all, we were all talking yesterday and, well, we decided that we would like to support the festival and, well, uh, however, uh, I understand how you feel about not wanting a club change and, uh, I think we all kind of feel that way. So as long as we're all working together, this club will never become something we don't want. I, um, uh, also, if you help us out with the festival, then I'll, uh, I'll buy you a new manga. That's all it took. That's all it took. <laughs> okay. 
sorry, that last part was really funny.